October 25th, 2019. That was the last time the Thompson Warriors lost a football game, a 26 game win streak heading into tonight. On the line, the Warriors against Oak Mountain. Let's roll the highlights. The number one team in the state, a coin toss from Alabaster, Alabama, the Thompson Warriors. They like to throw the ball early and they like to throw it often. There's one right there, Connor Harrell. He's going to link up to Justin Peagues. A 49 yard touchdown, 7 0 Thompson on the defensive side. Jeremiah Alexander, he's pretty good at football and he chases down the Oak Mountain quarterback and gets the sack. That's going to force a punt. Then Connor Harrell, he hits Ryan Pippins for an 11-yard touchdown. Thompson goes up 14-0 in the first. The final, Thompson wins and makes it 27 straight. Next week, the Warriors, they have a date with Hoover at the Hoover Met. Both teams are undefeated. Woodlong and Huffman, both with just one win on the year. They face off at Lawson Field. Who's going to win their second game of the season? The Huffman cheerleaders, they're excited for this matchup. A fun one tonight with the pink pom-poms. Huffman already up one in the score. Here's another one, an inside pass, an easy walk-in touchdown. Now, William Smith, he's in the second year as Huffman's head coach. It was Woodlawn's turn. Take a look at this play. It passed, deflected off. Huffman, Woodland's going to get it in for an easy touchdown. They did not draw it up like that, but I guess they're going to take it. But Huffman's turn on offense this time in the second quarter. They're going to go deep with a pass. What a throw and what a catch for a touchdown. The final Huffman wins big. 56 to 26. Vikings pick up their second win of the year. Woodland falls to 1 and 7 on the season. Spain Park and Vestavia tonight. Every point is a push up. So Vestavia, they hope for a lot of those tonight. Vestavia leading 24 to 6. First play of the second half. What a throw. Michael Towns to Cole Turner. 88 yard touchdown. 30 to 6 after a missed extra point. The next drive, Vestavia's John Paul, the quarterback. Oh, he's going to take it himself. 16 yards this time for the Vestavia score. The final, Vestavia wins big 37 to 6. The Rebels advance to 2 and 6 on the year. Center Point and head coach George Bates, they take on St. Clair County. Center Point to start the game. How about this? Javari Collier, two wide out, Camarius Horn for a big touchdown there. They score six and a lot more. The final score in this one, 52 to 16 to pick up their sixth win on the year.